What's going on guys? Falcons from Voltage Gaming here today. We're going to be showing you guys another tutorial on Grand Theft Auto Roleplay. Uh, today I'm going to be showing you the jobs uh, that we provide in Voltage Gaming. Uh, I do not know the some of them. I do not know the requirements 100%. All I know is that they require a lot than you'd expect. But anyway, let's get into this. All right, first, first up, as you join the server, you'll notice that in the top right, there is a time played uh, GUI type of thing. Uh, once it says two hours, that's the minimum requirement for your first job, which is police officer, which you can find in this building right here. Uh, once you go in, talk to the guy on the right. He will help you out in becoming an officer. You can also become swap, but that requires a lot more hours. I, I believe it's 72, which is three days. Or VIP. If you buy VIP, you pretty much unlock everything. Uh, phone operators, I'm not sure. I have five days, and obviously I just became it. But after that, there is a cheap spot. You need 64 hours of playtime and VIP plus. So you need, you need VIP and 64 hours of gameplay. Now SWAT, I'm not too sure, but you need to be 15 players on the server. Alright, our next job takes us over here to the city. Uh, there's two buildings right here. There is the firefighter and the paramedic. They both require four hours of gameplay. Here is the fireman job. You talk to the guy in the left. This is the firefighter. The fire chief, I believe, requires 64 hours in VIP, just like the firefighter. Now going to the left in the paramedic building, we have the uh, paramedics. Uh, you need four hours for this as well as firefighters, same thing. But here is where you get firefighters and also a quick tip of the day. Right across from the firefighter place and the paramedic place is the car dealer. You can buy and sell cars at that guy right there. Alright, moving on we have the road crew uh, job right here. Uh, the firefighter spot is just around the corner. That's the paramedic building you pretty much... Oh, shit. And here we are. We talked to this guy. I believe he needs 72 hours to become one. And, uh, by the way, all these jobs, if you want to become them, your car needs to be in the garage. You can't have your car out. It doesn't despawn it for you. You gotta put it back in the garage to become it. Alrighty, our final... Alrighty, next job. We're gonna be, uh... If you, uh, need a reference to where it is, there's the Bank of America. As you saw in our last episode with drugs, you come up the hill here, and at the RTA Hotel, you can become a bus driver. Now, this job allows you to pretty much carry around newcomers, more or less. Now, I do not know the requirements of this job. All I know is I have five days and gold VIP to become it. And as you see, there's the bus. All right, now there are other jobs. Uh, that we provide such as FBI and detective however FBI I believe is in this building next to the spawn so one of these doors there it is this guy right here lets you go FBI 64 hours and VIP plus to become FBI and then in the actual spawn itself you can uh, run for mayor you can uh, run for mayor I believe this needs 24 hours 12 hours, no, 24 hours, and then Secret Service, there needs to be a mayor, but you need 12 hours for this. I don't think, you do not need VIP for either of them. Uh, for Detective, I'm not gonna lie, I have absolutely no clue where that is, but Detective is another job you can become here. It's very fun, I enjoy it. That's it for today's, this week's episode, guys. I'm Falcons from Voltage Gaming. Don't forget to subscribe down below. Let us know how you thought about this video in the comments and drop that like bomb. Until next time, I'll see you guys later. Peace. I'm going to get there and hope we will meet there.